My name is Jordan Bramley and this is my Redken Artist Audition video. I have been licensed since 2007. I went to cosmetology school in 2006 in Southwest Florida. I have been doing hair ever since. Upon attending my first Redken Symposium in 2009, I really felt more of a passion for hair than what I had never felt before. It just really felt like home to me. Upon leaving there, I knew that what I wanted to do with my career, seeing these people on stage performing and spreading their knowledge was just something I knew I could do for my future and that I wanted to do for my career. I then was on a search to really find more of a Redken home base. I worked at multiple different salons and I just never really got the same feeling or passion as I did working for something that had to do with Redken. Their top-notch education and the way these artists perform is just such a humbling opportunity. When I finally did find a home with that, I decided to leave everything I knew in Florida and move to Milwaukee, Wisconsin. When I moved three years ago, I have now, since then, attended the Reckon Exchange in New York four times. I have also been now, this will be my fourth upcoming symposium in 2017, and I can't wait. I am now, as of September 2014, Redken Color Certified. I plan on taking my design certification in the fall. I really want to be any kind of aspect that I can be to the Redken industry and share any knowledge that I can give to anyone. I would really love to be an elite stylist of all aspects of education and using Redken's motto of learn better, earn better, and live better would truly be a defining moment in my career to help any young stylist of any age, younger, older, been doing this for a while, I feel like the humbleness that they give back is truly amazing. Love to be considered to be part of this team. Doing this is so second nature to me now and I feel like I couldn't do what I do every day without having Redken in my life. I want to help everyone I know to live better, earn better, and just be better. This is my model, Lena, and today we're going to be doing a balayage technique. So her hair has a little bit of a journey with it. She has been trying to go lighter and lighter. Previously in zone one, she had level four. and zone two to three, she was a little bit lighter, closer to a seven, but we're going to try and get her a little bit more balanced and even today. But we also want to keep the most integrity that we can for her hair. So when we do this balayage technique, we're going to achieve the most optimal amount of lightness through the ends, but also try to make it a little bit more soft as a grow out. At the end of this, we're also going to be doing a nice base break for her as well, just to really blend in the subtleness of it. Before we start Elena's color service today, we're going to be doing Redken's hair cleansing cream and pre-art. This is going to prep her hair for the color and also remove any impurities that she has left on her hair. We're gonna finish up after that with Redken's Extreme Shots Extreme and All Soft. To seal her ends and to close down the cuticle, we're gonna be using Redken's Fix Phase 3.5. just really going to ensure that the color takes the way that it's supposed to and like we said it's going to remove any product buildup or impurities that are left on her hair. The extreme shot is just going to add a more protein and the all soft is really just going to go in there and soften her hair so that the lightening process isn't as damaging.
she'll be ready for color.
With Elena's balayage today, we started in the back and worked from the bottom toward the front. Now we were taking a large triangle diagonal back sectioning so she can get optimal amount of subtleness with the ends being much lighter going towards the top. Today's formula was freehand red can blonde idle with 20 volumes. So our next step process is going to be we are, are going to be doing blonde idols base breaker and cool with 10 volume and we're going to be hitting that all over on her regrowth our third step after that is we're going to be using shades eq gloss to tone and balance out everything through her ends and the formula on that is 09p to equal parts clear with processing solution we're going to let that process for 15 minutes Now she's in the process. So we finished her color service and then we also finished up with Redken's chemistry system again. We did another shot of extreme and another shot of color extend and we sealed it up with the fixed face 3.5. And now I've got Elena in the horizontal breakdown and what we're going to do today is some vertical swelling laters. It's going to give her optimal amount of body and height and through the crown and top but also keep minimal um, trimming off the layering down here and off the length. So let's get started. So here's our end result. 
We got her a lot lighter and a much more cooler blonde. And what I also did when we were finishing, I round brushed and put in One United Glow Dry and Guts. And then we finished off with a three quarter inch Marcel wand with iron shape. And then we just really loosely just fingered this out a little bit. And then here she is.